Hi everyone, welcome to this lesson about the N operator. This lesson we are going to discuss the N operator, and this operator in SQL is used to specify many values in the where statement or in the condition that will be set after the where statement. And this is like shorthand for multiple or many or conditional statements. That's it simply, and I'll show you that. Welcome to the practical lesson about using the in operator. The in operator is used to specify many values in a where condition or in a where clause. And also, the in operator simply is a shorthand for multiple or logical operator or, log or logical conditions simply. You can use the in operator and also you can use not in operator. Let's see this in action. Let's get started by using the in operator in an example. At the beginning, you can see the select statement to select all the information or all the data from the seller table by using the select keyword followed by the asterisk symbol and after that the from keyword followed by the name of the table which is seller in this case our existing table in this data database and you can set from seller on the next line if you wish and after that you can see the where statement to set this condition where country in usa germany uk in this case the output will be all the records that contain usa germany and also uk in the country column from the seller table once you run this program by hitting by hitting f5 from the keyboard or running from the run button to execute this program you will get the output in a new result set or in a new table let's do that after running the program you will see this output on the screen as you can see number name code and country the four columns here and all the records all, or all the fields in the country column that have USA, Germany and UK and the output in a new result set and we have seven rows in the output in a new table as you can see execution finished without any errors and seven rows returned in 400 milliseconds that's it simply and also you can use the opposite which is not in instead of using the in operator to select only all the countries from the country field or the country table that don't have usa germany and uk replacing in with not in operator and run the program again and you will see the new output in a new result set without any complication we have eight rows printed and returned in 15 milliseconds and the execution also finished without any errors without any problems here you can try this by yourself and you can set another condition instead of country you can set code and n also use not n for example any specific numbers from this table here or you can use name the name column instead of country or any column from a table you created previously that's it so easy and so simple welcome to this lesson about logical operators in SQL in this course we are gonna talk about three logical operators and or and not operator the and operator first is used to display a record if all the conditions separated by the and operator are true if the right hand and the left hand of the and, the and operator are true the program will display that record for this operation and you can use the and operator uh, as a condition or uh, to set a condition after the where statement in the condition of the where statement and also the next one is called the or operator and this is used also 
in conditions after the or statement and this operator is used to display a record if any of the conditions separated by the, by the or operator is true if the right hand or the left hand if the right term or the left term of the or operator is true the program will display the result or will display or will select that record simply without any problem the next one is called not operator and this not operator is used to display a record if the condition is not true that's it simply and i will show you the three types of logical operators practically and in action you can use the logical operators and or and not operators in the condition of the where statement after selecting data let's see this in action at the beginning an example of using the AND operator the select statement at the beginning followed by the asterisk symbol and the from keyword to select from the seller table or any table you created inside this database our current table is called seller as you can see and the where statement after that to set this condition that contains the AND operator name is equal to Fred the name column when the field is equal to Fred and also country is equal to Peru and this program here will display or will, will select all the fields from the seller table where name is equal to Fred and also country is equal to Peru and the end operator in general is used to filter a record or to display a record if all the conditions separated by the AND operator are true if the two conditions in this case name is equal to Fred and country is equal to Peru are true and if you try to run this program you will get the output in a new result set as you can see name is equal to Fred and country is equal to Peru this output that matches this condition we set here using the AND operator and if any term of the two terms of the AND operator is false the program will not give you anything in the output let's see this let's change country from Peru to Germany for example in this case you can see no results in the output from the seller table because there are no records in th inside the seller table that have Fred as a value for name and also Germany as a value for the country column so you will get this output execution finished without errors and zero rows retained in 14 milliseconds that's it simply but in this case if you try to replace the AND operator with the OR operator you will get another output because the OR operator is used to display or select a record if any of the conditions separated by the OR operator is true if any of the two conditions in this case name is equal to Fred or country is equal to uh, is true but first let's use the OR operator with the name is equal to Fred and country is equal to Peru and you can see in this case by using the OR operator the result set or the table in the output selects all the fields from the seller table where name is equal to Fred or country is equal to Peru and if you try to change or replace uh, Peru with Germany you will get an output also the output in this case is all the fields that have Fred in the, na in the name column and also Germany in the country col column without any complication as you can see we have four records as an output in a new result set or in a, or in a new table and the execution finished also without any errors or problems and four rows retained in 18 milliseconds 
let's move on to talk about the node operator that will display a record if the conditions or the condition is not true in this example here after selecting all the data from the seller table we set the condition using the where statement and you can see the not operator after the where statement and the condition is not country is equal to Peru so you will get all the fields or all the records from the seller table that haven't country is equal to Peru or that haven't Peru as a field in the country column and you can see this output on the screen here 13 rows retained in 19 milliseconds in 19 milliseconds and the execution also finished without any errors simply and you can take a look at the output or in the new table look at the column called country the country column hasn't any record called Peru inside it using the condition where not country is equal to Peru. You can change this condition to country is equal to, for example, Germany, or you can change it and select names by using the name uh, column instead of using the country column and so on. Let's change country to Brazil to show the output and you can see the output on the screen. This is the new output. All the records or all the fields in the country column in the output haven't the selected item or the selected value. Another one, you can change Brazil to Canada for example. And in this case the program will give you the whole seller table because there is no field inside the country table or the country that has this value or this country inside it. So in this case, we got the whole seller table without any problems. You can see 15 rows retained in 19 milliseconds without any complication. Finally, let's take an example to combine the logical operators, for example, and and the OR operators on the same example, like this example here. Look at this condition. After selecting the whole data from the seller table, we set this condition country is equal to UK, and the output from the OR operator name is equal to Jack Will or code is equal to this code as you can see as you can see and you can see the or operator in this case is surrounded by round braces and any result from the or operator will be added as the right term of the and operator to give you an output and the output in this example simply is a single row or a single record from the seller table that has UK in the country column and Jack Will in the name column as you can see without any problems. The output from the OR operator is Jack Will for name and also the output from the AND operator in this case country is equal to UK and name is equal to Jack Will. This record or this row in a new result set in the output without any problems and the execution also finished without getting an error or anything like that. Only one row, single row returned in 31 milliseconds. Another example, you can use the opposite of the AND operator which is AND NOT operator. And we have an example here we combined the NOT operator with the AND NOT operator and in this example, this example will select all the fields from the seller table where country is not equal to France and also is not equal to Germany without any problems and by running this program you will get the output on the screen in a new result set and you can see on the country column in the result set we got the output without getting France for country and Germany also for country as you can see you can take a look at the country column and you can do this for any column with another condition instead of country is equal to France or country is equal to Germany you can change uh, country to name and set 
any name you wish and also and not another name or you can change the country from France to Venezuela or Portugal or any country in the country column here and also you can do the same thing for Germany you can change Germany to Spain to UK to USA and this is so easy as you can see I hope that you enjoyed this lesson thank you so much for watching see you again next lesson